Today we're opening a $50 mystery box versus a $100 legendary collection. What's up guys, we're back with another epic video. Today we are finally opening this legendary collection Kaiba that I've had for a little bit. I was waiting for another legendary collection, I just haven't gotten one yet, so we're gonna do it versus a mystery box, which is always fun. And the mystery box we chose is the one that has been pretty clutch for us, the monster box, so hopefully today we can have some crazy pulls, but first we have a giveaway. I'll be giving away these three cards. All you have to do is like this video, be subscribed, and let me know what you think will win, the monster box or the legendary collection. All right, let's Let's start off with the Legendary Collection Kaiba. I have not opened one of these since it came out. Yeah, it's been a very long time since I've, I've opened one of these, I should say. So, there's Ash Blossom in here. There's a lot of crazy epic cards, so let's see what we can pull. I don't really remember everything in here. I remember pulling double Ash Blossom out of, like, one of these or something. It was crazy. And three out of two or something. It was really awesome. Okay, inside we're going to get a promo pack and five packs. So, here's our promo pack. I don't think there's really anything too incredible in this one, so we're not even going to bother opening that. Then we have our... Oh, it's only three packs in this. I forgot about that. Three packs only. It's kind of weird. So these could be very hit or miss because there's only three separate packs. I think there's like multiple secrets in it. I can't remember how this works. It's been honestly since it came out. I don't remember when that was. Like 2019 maybe? So let's see what we can pull. We're going to start off with a Maiden with Eyes of Blue. That's a very cool secret rare card. Okay. The Neutron Blast. All right. That's pretty cool as well. So I think the last two are also secret rare. So we got a Dragoonity Phalanx. Okay. Dragoonities are everywhere. Ghost Reaper and Winter Cherries. Cool. Master with Eyes of Blue. A lot of Blue Eyes stuff, of course. Legendary Collection. Kaiba. The Blue Eyes Twin Burst Dragon. Very awesome. I love this card. Dragoonity Legionnaire. All right. A more Dragoonity. I don't know why they like Dragoonity so much. I've noticed this because of auction series. How much they put Dragoonity and stuff. I don't really get it, but they do. Protect with Eyes of Blue. So Dragoonity and Blue Eyes so far. Terraforming. That's actually a sick secret rare. Okay. You can't really see it when it goes into like space, basically. But uh, the rest of it is pretty cool. Let's see. And a Polymerization. That's a beautiful one. Check that out. Oh, yeah. That's nice. Okay. Next pack. Let's see. Pretty cool. So I, I can't really remember what the other big... Maybe like Droll... Is Droll in here maybe? I can't remember what all the big cards were. Sea Crush Wyvern. That's a pretty cool looking card. The Secret Rush from the set are really nice though. I'll give them that. Made with Eyes of Blue. We've already gotten that one unfortunately. So that's a double. The Heavy Mech Support Platform. Exile of the Wicked. I think this was the first printing since like TP3 or something. Okay, that's a cool one. Tiger Dragon. Uh, did I think Kaiba might have actually used that card at some point, which I guess is why it's in here. XYZ Dragon Cannon. The original art looks way better to me. I don't know about you guys. Let me know in the comments. Do you like the original art or this alternate art? Rider of the Storm Winds. I do not remember this card. Okay, that's a tuner, and it works with Dragon Normal Monsters. Okay, makes sense. I've never heard of that one, so it must not be that good. Mirror Force, just a regular Ultra. So we're not into the secrets yet. We got two more secrets in this pack. And Dragon Master Knight, 5k attack, 5k defense. There's the Blackluster Soldier back there. That's a pretty cool looking one. And can we get Ash? Enemy controller, left, right, A, B. I definitely went backwards right there, but that's fine. Okay, so honestly, it feels like the monster box might have a chance because we've pulled some cool cards, but nothing like that crazy out of this so far. So are we going to have a chance? We're about to find out. Ash Blossom could change it. Blue Eyes Shining Dragon. That is a beautiful print. I will give it that. Wow. Even though Retro Pack has the Secret Rare, that is also a very nice looking one. Ancient Rules. Pretty cool card. I don't think it's too valuable. I think it has a little bit though. Castle of Dragon Souls. Pretty creepy looking castle there. That's for sure. Oh, Droll and Lockbird is in here. That's probably pretty expensive. Okay. It's just an Ultra Rare. That's probably pretty expensive. That's... The Blue Eyes White Dragon SDK art. Okay, this pack is getting much better. This last one is really saving us. Protect with Eyes of Blue. Okay, we have like a play set of this now. Z Metal Tank. Very cool, very cool. Thunder Dragon. Not a bad printing for this one as well because I think this is only ultra printing or maybe even hollow printing. Beacon of White. Okay, pretty cool, pretty cool. Can we get the Ash Blossom? No, it's a spell. Return of the Dragon Lords this is another good one. This card's like 10 bucks, I think. Okay, that's a good one. That was a really good pack. All right, I thought Monster Box had a chance. Then we opened that last pack, and that made it a lot more difficult. We're going to need to pull something crazy. But as you guys know, the packs in this mystery box are actually pretty good. We do have some potential for some big pulls. It's time for the mystery to come through. 
I don't know if a mystery box. I think maybe one time a mystery box has won one of these. So let's see if we can, uh, you know, break the streak. We have. Oh, look. Fusion Enforcers. Can we pull the legendary Alistair himself or a Mechaba or something like that? Let's go. I don't know if it'll be at the front. Just in case we're going to do it like that. We have a Fluffle Penguin. We love the little penguins. It's pretty cool. The Edge M Chain. I remember uh, losing any of these guys. The Toy Vendor also lost to that card. Okay. Miracle Eyes Fertile. It was at the front. I was right. Okay, let's see. What Secret Rare? Can we get an Invoked card? It's a Fusion. Invoked Magellanica. That's pretty cool. This is the one nobody really uses because it doesn't have an effect, but it is very large. So, very cool card. We'll take that. I'd say a pretty decent start so far. It could be a lot worse. What is this? It's like a flap in there. All right, we'll just go past that. We have a Breakers of Shadow. We have a Chris Bosch pack. Here we go. What can we pull? Okay, there's no Ghost Rares. I think this is right after they got rid of Ghost Rares. So we're looking for it. There's a regular rare. I think we would still get a foil at the end. Okay. Forbidden Apocrypha. Mistaken Accusation. It was an accident. Solo, the Melodious Songs. Just all right, Han. We've got a Sirenui style synthesis. All right. Purple Power Rain Goat. Rain Goat. What does that mean? Okay, Destruction Sword Flash and Interrupted Kaiju Slumber. That's a pretty cool card, actually. Interrupted Kaiju Slumber. I don't know the value of it, but very cool card. Okay, a couple of decent pulls. Next pack, we have a Shining Victories, the brothers. These came out, like, I think right after each other or something, very close together. Can we pull something Blue Eyes? We've already had Legendary Collection Kaiba, so let's just add to our Blue Eyes stuff here. Let's do three this time, because last time we grabbed the rare. The Kaiju Files. Man, they really want us to play some Kaijus. we got the Dwarf Star Planeter. Digital Bug Centibit. Digital Bug Cocoon Dancer. Raid Raptor Pain Lanius. we got the Forge of the True Dracos. Cosmo Scaredy Lion. Amorphage. Wait, was that a... That was a hollow. Cosmo Scaredy Lion. This is Wizard of Oz? I think it is, because they do, like, Star Wars Wizard of Oz. Okay, there's a super rare. On to the next pack. We have... Uh-oh, what is that? What is that? We have Flames of Destruction. I think these are always pretty similar, but they're very good packs, though, so I don't really mind the fact that they're consistent. It's not like Fist of the Gadget. It's a little different there. Limit Code. Yajiro Invader. Trickstar Mandrake. Element Saber Malo. Tin Dangle Trinity. We got the Prompt Thorn. Three trolling trolls. Wait. Speak of the devil. Those fists of the gadgets made their way into it. All right. World Legacy Sorrow. That's our super rare and revenge ed executor. All right. All right. All right. We got more coming. We got more coming. Okay. Next pack. We have. Oh, Legend of Blue Eyes White Dragon. This could turn it around if we get that Blue Eyes White Dragon. Let's do this. Or anything else like Dark Magician. That would be good as well. So let's go like this. Do a little of that. Let's go with the Yame. Where's the Mazurizame? We got the Windy Phantom. Not Windy. <laughs> Windies. Okay. Wasteland. We got the Masaki Legendary Swordsman. The Man Eater. Not the bug. The plant. All right. You know, Tom. We got that. You think the Man Eater bug like lives on the Man Eater plant? Who knows? Two Mount Dark Ruler. We got the Ray and Temperature. And the Dragon Capture Jar. All right. We failed. But it's not over yet. Still many packs to go. What will we get? We have Cybernetic Horizon. Time to pull that Boral Sword. Let's see. Boral Sword. Make your appearance. Starting right now. Crusadia Reclusia. Boral Regenerator. The Cyber Dragon Veer. Okay. The Contact Gate. Crusadia Power. I didn't know Veer was that new. Dragoonity Legion. Every pack has Dragoonity. Crusadia Equimax. I didn't know that was going to be there. Okay, the Crusadia Equimax Ultra Rare. Another decent pull. These monster boxes always seem to have good pull rates. I don't know why. Still a few to go. Let's go with this one. This is Maximum Crisis. We opened 300 packs of this and pulled, what was it? Five Ash Blossoms or four? I can't remember. That was a pretty crazy opening. Let's see if we can uh, back it up right here. Let's go Phantasm Spiral Grip. Lyralist Cobalt Sparrow. I didn't know these were that old. Oh, okay. Break away. Break away. All right, gift exchange. We got the Speedroid. The Ghost Beef. <gasps> the Ghost Beef. Wow, that's an epic card. Zodiac Hammer Kong. Supreme King Gate Infinity and the Ariel. Okay, Ariel. We got the Supreme King Gate Infinity. All right, super rare. Two more packs. Let's go with this one. No, this one. This one. Oh, we always end up with this one toward the end. The Duelist Alliance Pack. Ghost Rare, Ultimate Rare Potential. 
So many good cards. So many good common cards in this set. So let's see what we can pull out of this set. Let's get some good ones. White Prince. That's a good card. Okay. Artifact Chakram. Formal Pal Skeeter Skimmer. Artifact Lance. Yes, you look at these commons. They're crazy. Stellar Knight, or Stellar Knight Alpha. Swordfish. Hippo Carnival. Shadal Dragon and UA Stadium. Shadal Dragon's a pretty cool card, and UA Stadium's always fun. All right, that was not bad, but I think we're going to need something pretty big to win this one. We have double LOB pack. Okay, we've got a second chance at the Legend of Blue Eyes. This is pretty cool. I wasn't expecting a double LOB pack. Okay, so we know that the fourth card would be it. This is what it... Okay, we got to get this right. Here we go, like that. We have a Wasteland. Our mail. Dark... Gray. All right. Power of Kaishin. Metabat. The Green Phantom King. Can we get that Blue Eyes White Dragon? Dark Magician. Red Eyes Black Dragon. Exodia. Anything. Gaia. We take that. Larvis. Fissure. And the final card. Will it be a hollow? Machine Conversion Factory. No. Oh, wait. There's another pack? There's another pack in here. I was about to throw this away. Wait. There's another pack. Dark Saviors, it's not over with. Let me double check in here. Okay, we're, we're, I think we're good to go. See, this flap is what I'm talking about. Let me show you guys. You guys see this? This thing was very confusing. This one was hiding on the other side. This opening is not done. Dark Saviors said that, that we're going to bring this thing back. Monster Box, baby. Okay, will the secret be at the front? I don't know. What can we even pull to save us? Bravo for hire. That's fun. Shadow Vampire, super rare. I don't know what we can pull to save us. Dompa, another fur hire card. I think there's all fur hires is in the set. It's when they released, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Oh, and a Shark Can. That's not a bad. And a Plague Spreader, another good card. That was a pretty good pack. Shark Can, and I know it was worth a few bucks, so definitely help the case for that one. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more epic content. Shout out to TCG, Trusted Cards, Tone Flow Show, Tomato Juice, Stanley, Mike Nance, Mimic Gecko, Daxter, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, Anunatai Show, and JT Cho. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.